Hello, everyone. Welcome. Peace to you. Blessings. Um, I'm Davi. I'm here with my friend and colleague, Stevie. We both serve on the Church Development Committee for the Pacific Northwest Conference. Um, so good to be with you all uh, today. Um, we're going to be sharing about a new grant opportunity coming up. But first, um, the Church Development Committee is uh, one of the committees of the Pacific Northwest Conference. It's our job to support congregations who are either coming into the life of the Pacific Northwest Conference, joining the UCC for the first time, uh, new church plants it, is our work, um, but also just um, finding ways for existing congregations to grow their ministry, to expand in who God's calling them to be. Um, recently, a cool way we got to do that is with the Solidarity Fund. Um, we got to give away, I think, about $300,000 to um, congregations that were um, in need of extra support, especially in the early days of the coronavirus pandemic and, and other, other ways that that um, kind of affected their ministries or ways they needed to adapt. So um, it's a lovely team and we have some exciting news to share with you today. Yes, today we are here to talk to you about the Anti-Racism Community Engagement Grant. This is a new grant opportunity we have. It's about $125,000 total of funds we have to give away. And we're really excited the projects that we're looking at for this are projects that congregations bring um, that focus especially with an anti-racism lens or for an anti-racism project and projects that engage the community. And so whether that means your outside community or some of your local UCC or other congregations in the area to come together to bring projects that engage your community, hopefully bring life to your congregation, bring life to those around you, work towards justice. Um, and again, just to um, really privilege those that come with an anti-racist lens or framework for those projects. Those are the type of projects we're looking to fund. And we are super excited. We know that across the Pacific Northwest Conference, your churches, your congregations, your community needs are all different. Um, and we also recognize that you're all, you're all likely on different paths towards what it uh, towards discovering what it means to be an anti-racist congregation. So we're excited to hear about the different projects, the different spaces that y'all are in to um, to kind of bring these ideas to life. And we're also hoping that this process will be really conversational. And so um, we don't expect you to come with a plan that is fully fleshed out. We're hoping that we, as the Church Development Committee, can help have conversation about ways that these projects can um, engage your communities, engage congregations with one another, um, and to kind of imagine more broadly what these projects can look like. So um, just to say a little bit about what uh, applying for this grant looks like, um, if you have maybe the beginnings of an idea or maybe a fully formed idea, maybe you wanna um, bring in some anti-racism trainings for your congregation. Maybe you know just the community nonprofit that you wanna partner with to um, share space or share programming. Uh, maybe you know the um, churches in your uh, region that you wanna reach out to. Um, whatever you have, even if it's just an inkling, um, we, we'd invite you to submit um, a very simple uh, letter of interest. Um, there's more details about where to send that and, and so forth in the letter that is hopefully attached to this video. Um, but uh, we don't want the application process to be a real barrier for folks. Instead, we want it to be um, kind of a point of entry into a conversation. Um, you've got a great idea and you send it to us and it turns out that your idea is a lot like this idea that uh, a church on the other side of the state or on the other side of your city is, is also thinking about. So putting folks in conversation, um, helping to uh, germinate um, conversations. Um, but yeah, so um, a letter of interest that is um, three or four paragraphs laying out what you're thinking about, what it's likely to cost, what your context is like, uh, and then we can take the conversation from there. But speaking of conversations, we also have another opportunity coming up. Yes. So part of this process, Davi and I will be hosting uh, some Zoom workshops for folks who are interested in applying for these grants. Uh, the times, the dates of those will, again, be in that letter that should be attached to this. And these are spaces where you can bring your questions. We'll have a little bit of information at the front of the meeting, but it's also a space where you can bring ideas if you have them and want to talk about them with other churches, other folks in the conference. Uh, but it's also a space where you can come and listen. Say you are interested thinking about maybe um, applying for this grant, but you don't have a solid idea yet. 
uh, come listen to the ideas that the rest of the folks in the conference bring, um, kind of spitball with us, uh, talk, and we can give you ideas, right, as we are having these conversations about um, ways that you can connect with other churches. This is, can also be a place of connection with those other congregations. If you hear an idea that another church, right, across town, across the state has, and you're like, we want to be in on that. This is a space where we can do that as well. Um, so please come to those Zoom conversations. Again, dates, times in the letter that is there. Um, and say you can't come to the Zoom conversation, we would still love to have a conversation with you. So please feel free to reach out to Dobby, to me, um, to Dave Shane on the uh, Church Development Committee. Our email addresses are in that letter again, but we would love to see you at the Zoom meetings. And if you can't make it there, please, please, please feel free to reach out to us. As you can tell, we're really excited about this new granting opportunity. Um, I, I'm I'm really looking forward to some of these conversations. And, and maybe you're watching this and you're like, you know, I, I don't know if I have capacity for this. Maybe you're an overwhelmed pastor. Maybe you're an overwhelmed moderator. Maybe you're an overwhelmed music minister. But maybe there's somebody else in your congregation who uh, might want to kick this around, come to one of these conversations, might have some good ideas on this. Feel free to send this video along, send that letter along, and, and we'll, we'll talk to whoever shows up. Um, thank you so much for listening. We're really looking forward to the ideas y'all bring. Um, we're excited for the ways that the Spirit can move in the conference with this grant money, and we're excited to see your applications. Thanks so much. Amen.